the Pioneer Fireplace, these guys have come uh, highly recommended. They seem to be the cat's pajamas when it comes to uh, anything to do with wood stoves. Yeah, so they've come highly recommended and uh, I'm gonna go in there and uh, see about getting a glass for this little sucker here. Okay, let's go in there. Ciao. So I got the prognosis in uh, Pioneer Fireplace here and uh, this glass for this door it's uh, he's he's gonna order it out of Nanaimo there uh, their main office is in Nanaimo so he's gonna order it it'll take roughly a week to get here because um, I think the truck comes up once a week or something anyway this glass is gonna be like eighteen dollars and ninety cents someone out there said it was gonna cost me 45 bucks online on Amazon and uh, yeah I'm not gonna go that way this is going to cost me $18.90 for the glass. Um, it needs a, a gasket that goes around in the front here, all the way around. Keep it in airtight and all that. And they're going to mount the gasket on uh, before I pick up the glass. And so it's going to be all ready to go. Just slide it in, um, uh, bolt it down, and uh, we're ready to go. And the gasket's about 6 to 7 bucks, so it's going to be... Uh, 18. It's going to be under 30 bucks total for uh, the whole thing, including tax, for the glass and the gasket, and we're all ready to go, and that'll be f perfect. And I just have to wait about a week, so that'll be cool. I can't uh, can't wait for that. So let's move on and do something else. Ciao. Someone just has an amazing time all by herself in the tall grass. Oh, there she goes. Yeah, she just loves to play and play and play in the tall grass here. And uh, she goes nuts, goes crazy. Must be something in there that she has a lot of fun with. <laughs> See you later. Bye. Angel just loves to antagonize baby. They're playing. They're playing, but it's... Uh... <laughs> baby says, piss off, you little monkey fart. Right? Right, baby? <laughs> piss off, you little monkey fart. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they're done for now, I guess. Ciao. Well... I didn't get a lot of filming done today. Uh, first of all, I slept in this morning. <laughs> I had to just jump up, grab a quick bite, and take the girls and head out. I had to go, uh, go into Parksville. I had to uh, look into that glass for that wood stove there, and, uh, which we set up and arranged. So I just wait for that to come in in about a week, I guess. And then I had to run over to Parks West and get a bunch of photos. Uh, downloaded off my phone into photos um, off my phone camera <laughs> and uh, yeah I just had a lot of running around to do a bunch of errands and everything uh, it was kind of boring couldn't stop and film it no big deal uh, nothing film worthy anyway so uh, yeah we had to do all that done so I didn't get a lot of filming done you can see I'm in my uh, kind of semi-winter fleece 
jacket. Yeah, the nights have been getting a little cooler here. Uh, definitely the uh, definitely the season's changing a bit. So getting a little cooler off and on some nights. But anyway, one thing we did get here. Got this here. So let's go have a look at these. One thing I got to do is I got to get on top of getting uh, my logos done for my uh, stickers and business cards and banners and uh, stuff like that. And uh, st uh, sticker uh, logo thing for members only and all that kind of stuff. And my merchandise, get all that happening. Uh, because I'm way behind on it kind of thing, in my mind anyway, way behind, but uh, let's just check out what we got today here. Okay. So we got a bunch of photos here. Got them uh, downloaded, uh, printed off my phone. <laughs> of course, there's the first one, right? <laughs> That one, yeah, I'm gonna crop that one, maybe do it in an oval or something. That'll go on, I don't know, coffee mugs, t shirts, uh, uh, hoodies, any kind of merch kind of thing. There's another one there, that I like this one, that's a good one. Good one, a baby. I gotta crop these kind of thing and put some uh, lettering on there, like uh, maybe me, tiny house on wheels or something. This is one. I got a bunch of doubles here for some reason. I don't know what I was doing, but there's one I took that it's got cut off at the bottom. But this is the one I was looking for. This one here. That's the one I use for Baby and Me Tiny House on Wheels. Yeah. <laughs> there it is again. <laughs> yeah. Told you I got doubles here. And this one here. I like this one. Oh, that's a cool one. And another double. <laughs> oh, and this one here is cute. <laughs> So these are all going to be uh, possible logos for my uh, merchandise and everything else, including stickers and stuff. Uh, another double up. But I'm going to also, uh, i got to give a couple of these over to uh, some kind of cartoonist or whatever they call that, caricaturist. And uh, so they can, uh, you know, do a sort of a cartoon characterish kind of uh, logo for me and then put the uh, printing on for... There's another one I got kind of by mistake. <laughs> That's this one here. But yeah, see if I can get uh, some of these done and uh, maybe get some uh, cartoon character kind of things happening here. Some more of that, more of this one, and I got a couple of these. <laughs> Baby with her one eye, her eye patch. Doubles, doubles, doubles. And I got the little angel here. Uh, I think that's going to be it for now. But uh, so I got I got a lot to work with here, and uh, like I said, I got to get someone to do the kind of cartoon character kind of things for stickers and things, and. Uh, Maybe just on some stuff, just do the actual photo. Like I can use this photo here. And uh, this photo there. And uh, use them on, uh, let's say, my banners or stuff. And uh, possibly on a t-shirt or whatever. And uh, yeah, we'll just uh, have to sort these out and go through them all. And uh, see which ones we want to work with. And uh, which one the artist wants to work with on doing the artwork and stuff. And uh just take it from there, so that's pretty cool, eh? All right, I'm gonna pack these up and put them away and go through them later. I gotta get ready for tomorrow anyway. So we'll talk to you soon, bye. baby how you doing i love you yeah so this is probably going to be a shorter video today a little bit shorter uh like i said i didn't get a lot done today not a lot of filming anyway i had so much running around to do and uh 
Then we just got back a while ago, maybe an hour ago. And I have to go to bed early because uh, I need my beauty sleep and Lord knows I need lots of that. But uh, no, I got to get to bed early because I got to get up early. Um, we, uh, I have to go down uh, down at Yvonne's place, go uh, drop my camper off, camper trailer, uh, un unhook it and drop it off there. And then we got to go down and have uh, something at the kitchen there, have some lunch at the kitchen. Then we got to pick up Derek at the kitchen. He's going to, uh, he's the driver for uh, Yvonne's vehicle. So after we have lunch, all three of us and the puppies are going to uh, jump in the truck and go down in Nanaimo. We have to go to Service BC of all things. I've never heard of this. It's really ridiculous. Go to Service BC to get a release for him so that the towing company can re release his vehicle. It's really kind of weird. But, so we got to do that first thing. Go over and grab his vehicle. And, uh, and then uh, Derek's going to drive it home. Or drive it back to uh, Qualicum for Yvonne. And then i got to drive Derek back to Nanaimo, I think, maybe. I might be able to just take him to the bus stop and he heads back on the bus. That'll be up to him, though, anyway. So it's going to be a busy day. I don't know how much filming I'm going to get tomorrow because it's kind of a boring thing to do and go about. So, I don't know. We'll see what happens there and uh, just go from there. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to probably just finish this video now and... Uh, give you just a quick update on our day today <laughs> and uh, we'll see what happens tomorrow okay so I let you just watch the little puppies with uh, a little song at the end <laughs> ciao for now